Hey guys, welcome back to Cur Let's Play Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland. Yeah, I haven't seen you guys in a while. I haven't recorded in uh, about five days, I would say. And um, today we're going to do the boss rush. Uh, it's in sub games. And, oh, I'm sorry, boss endurance. Um, this is extremely difficult. I've yet to beat it, but I, I get really close to the end. What you have to do is you have to go through every single boss with uh, just one life, and you don't get any healing items, nothing. So it can, it's really difficult. Um, the furthest I've gotten was the last boss, which is uh, Nightmare, I think his name is. But um, I've yet to beat him because I usually only have one vitality point at the end, which is uh, almost impossible. But, um, I've been training for like a day, well, not like a day straight, it'd be kind of crazy, but I've been training for a while, and this is extremely difficult level, or extra, I, t I should say. Okay, Mike is a very, uh, helpful thing to have here, but I like the spark ability better. Uh, let's see if I get it here. Nope. Uh, the wheel ability is completely useless on this level, because, uh, he's always sitting, he's always against the wall. Oh, he started pretty quickly that time. Well, he's always against the wall, which means you can't run into him because you have to turn around, and when you turn around, you're vul you're vulnerable. Jeez, this guy's destroying me. I usually uh, I try not to get a hit on me until uh, um, until uh, what's what's the name of that thing? Uh, Meta Knight. And then there were a few times when I didn't get hit on Meta Knight. But uh, I'm really bad at the at the uh, fight before the last boss, which is that one where you're uh, in the air. I'm I'm really bad at it. But uh, I'm pretty sure I won't be able to beat beat uh, beat it this time because I have half my life so far, which is not good at this point. You shouldn't be you really shouldn't be getting hit at all. Well, I mean you're supposed to get hit. Well, you're not. I'm, well, it's not like you're supposed to get hit, and it's not like you're not supposed to get hit. Because, you know, you have some margin of error, but... I, I think I uh, surpassed that margin. Yeah, so, um... Uh, about the extras, I don't think I'm gonna actually do that mode. Because, um... Really, it's the same thing. Just with Meta Knight. It's, it's called Meta Nightmare, or something like that. Meta Knight mode, whatever you want to call it. And you get it when you 100% the extra mode, and I really don't feel like doing that. I'm sorry, but it's the exact same game, and I don't want to play through it three times. You know? Ah, oh, man. Oh no. Oh, I'm gonna lose now. I lost, I lost high jump ability. High jump ability makes King Deity so easy. I only have two vitality points left. There's no way I'm gonna beat him. I wish you could keep your sword ability, but you can't, I don't think. This is this part is cool though because you keep like even if you get hit by Meta Knight, you, you don't lose the sword ability. That's pretty cool. Jeez, I am not doing well. Yeah, you kinda have to wait for Meta Knight to attack you. Oh, that was close. And then and then counter him while he's like standing still. Oh, oh, it's close. Can I get him? Oh. Aw, oh, no. Okay, I can beat him. Ah, oh, alright, whatever. I guess I'll just play through it again. Uh, this will probably be a bunch of failures, one after another. Um, if it gets too bad, I'll just show each individual fight. Uh, well, actually, I don't know what I'll do. Um, if it gets to be that I actually can't beat him, beat it, um... Well, I'm sure I'll be able to beat it at one point. What I'll do is, uh, if I can't beat it within two more tries, because I've been trying it a long time, I will cut to the end after I beat the last boss. Does that sound like that? Well, <laughs> I shouldn't be asking you because you can't answer. Ball, ball ability is pretty helpful on this part. Because, uh, he, oh, maybe it's not, maybe it's not helpful. Spark ability, there we go. That's the one I wanted. Alright, because spark ability, you can just kind of stand there and he takes a lot of damage from it. And also, it's pretty helpful on this boss. Not that this boss is very difficult, it's just that it makes it go by much quicker. 
I, I was looking up like a like a like a uh, speed run of boss endurance because I wanted to see like what some people's strategies were, and um, there was this one guy who beat it in like four four minutes and twenty seven seconds, and that was a uh, non task. And the uh, the TSA run was um oh, I'm sorry the TAS run uh, was like three twenty or something. That's crazy. But I mean, I guess tasks are supposed to be crazy, but it's kind of like it's really, really crazy. Because um, well, actually, I don't know what my best time was, like getting to the final boss or getting close to beating it. Because I don't, th I think I, I think I have it down to a pretty quick art almost. Because I've been, like I said, I've been practicing a lot for this. Like I only have two minutes so far. Ah, I hate it when the uh, things aren't regular, like the movements they have. Like there, that, that wasn't fair. I think this is the angriest you'll ever see me. Hopefully, I don't like I, I want to keep myself calm when I'm doing these LPs, but this is really frustrating me now. Cause again, I have two vitality going into the midnight -like fight. <sighs> All right, maybe I can do better this time. It's good to get like a good chunk of his health down at, right in the beginning. Oh, that was good. Okay. Like the TAS I saw, or the speedrun I saw, they just let, they just like stood there and did that. Um, just while he was hitting them. Man, alright. He just stood there and pressed the B button while Meta Knight was hitting them, and he only got like, three vitality. He only had three vitality left at the beginning of the DDD fight. And he beat the game, he beat it with one vitality left. So, that was pretty cool, but, uh, you know what? I might as well just give up for this try if I get hurt on Wispy Woods. That's kind of embarrassing. So yeah, I'll be uh, I'll do one more time. Goodness gracious, I am terrible at this game. Oh, also, you guys aren't gonna believe how stupid I am, but um, the uh, last couple episodes I noticed that it was not the uh, the narration, the uh, narrating um volume was really low and sounds kind of like tunnel, like in a tunnel, and I realized because, well there's a, I have a headset that I plug into my computer to narrate, to capture my voice, but um, my computer also has a built-in microphone because it's a laptop, and um, apparently I did not plug in my headset, and it was recording, um, it was recording my voice from the microphone on the computer, which is why it sounds so poorly. So I apologize for that, but it'll be better now. Hopefully it'll be much better. Um, I, I think I have a uh, solution to the audio problem as well, like the uh, the weird audio. Um, that won't become apparent, like, I, w I won't be able to fix that until the next LP though. So. So look forward to that, you know? <laughs> I like to try and guess which one it is going to be before I uh, actually get get uh, attack them. I like the parasol ability. Uh, even when you're running away, kind of hurts them. Like if they run into this little back thing, kind of hurts them a little bit. But um, I think burning ability would actually be pretty cool. But it's pointless to get any ability beforehand. Like I mean, it would be cool to fight uh, DDD with because you have to use high jump ability. You think you could just jump up here, but uh, he follows you up, and if you're not going fast enough, he will catch up to you, and he, and like he'll harm you, and uh, you know you don't you want to avoid the damage as much as possible. Yeah, so like Krakow and um, the paint guy and Mennonite are the ones that give me the most trouble, and the and the fight before the last battle. I don't know what it is. Like, uh, lately, this guy's been giving me a lot of trouble. I don't know why. I used to be doing, like, really well on this guy. But now I'm, like, afraid to even go near him. Ah, uh -huh. I think brown gives you hammer and red get like, the missiles that he throws out. I think brown gives you hammer and the red gives you, a uh, hammer. Uh, I'm sorry, sleep. I just said hammer. Okay, three vitality points is a little bit better. Still, what? Oh, he, he almost never does that. 
Okay. <laughs> I'm doing really badly. Can I still... I, I'm almost... Oh, okay. Um... Oh, sorry about that. Um... I will... Cut... No, I can't do that. I'll do it one more time. I still have like five minutes left. I'll do it one more time, and then I'll show you the ending. Alright. And, uh, if you really want to see Meta Knight mode, I'm sure you can find it somewhere on YouTube. You know? Like, um... <clears throat> I was only really going to show like five minutes of it anyway. And it seems kind of like a waste of time, almost. So I'm really sorry if you were looking forward to that, but I just... I don't really want to play through the game again. So, uh, please don't think lovely of me. <laughs> I played it pretty close to its fullness. No, I didn't mean to suck him up. I meant to, uh... There we go. I'll just throw this at him. Because the wheel... Like I said, the wheel ability is useless. Now, there's a good ability. Um... I hate when he's jumping up there, because I can never predict if he's going... Which way he's jumping. Oh, that's close. So this time I'm gonna try and not get hit at all. Like I, I like to pretend that I only have like one HP the entire time, so it'll make me feel more careful. Okay, okay, I need to kill. Him. Uh, good thing he didn't start moving forward, or else that would have killed, uh, not killed me, damaged me. But like I said, I pretend like it's gonna kill me. Like um. I, I never knew this before I actually looked at the uh, speed run of this, that you could press... Aw, oh, GC caught up with me. Aw, oh, man. Alright, I will see you in a minute. Or rather, in like one second for you guys. Okay guys, back. I um, just defeated him, and uh, here's the ending animation where he uh, kind of blows up on my... Well, implodes, I guess. Because he doesn't really cause an explosion, but he just kind of folds in onto himself. Is there something I have to... Okay. And there I go. I completed in 6 minutes and 8 seconds. So, uh... What do I get for that? Diddly squat. Except for this, uh... Congratulations message. Um... Yeah, so, like, uh... I guess I could, uh, show off the sound test, maybe? I don't know. Oh, uh, let's see how many there are. Oh, 43. Okay. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't sew it off. Um. To tell you the truth, uh, I think this is pretty much it for this project. Um. I guess, uh, for the next episode I'm gonna do. Will be the first episode of my next Let's Play. Um. I won't reveal it yet. Or you'll find out when I upload it. Which should be. Pretty soon, uh, excuse me, pretty soon, um, yeah, pretty soon after I upload this, I'll be uploading it, because I, I, um, oh wait, I can't videotape, I can't tape while it's rendering. Well, anyway, I'll see you soon, and thanks a lot for joining me in my first Let's Play, I really had a lot of fun, and, um, I hope you continue to, uh, I hope you continue to watch my next Let's Plays. Thank you, and have a great day.